College basketball, there is nothing counterfeit about the Bucks of East Tennessee State. You get your money's worth watching the 13th ranked team in the country. And tonight, with revenge in their eyes, ETSU hosted the team that handed them one of their two losses this season, Tennessee Chattanooga. The box won the previous meeting by two points. Over 12,000 fans on hand for East Tennessee State. Tyrone Enoch's pass intercepted by Alvin West, and it was ETSU up by 17 early. Mr. Jennings to Rodney English, Bucks by 18 at the half. The move of the night by Enoch between the legs, the spin, the dish, Bart Redden for the layup. And the ETSU fans didn't like the moccasins treading on their turf. Enoch tries it again, but Rodney English sends it out of here. The Bucks from then on, the three on one, Alvin West, Jerry Pelfrey, Calvin Telford, one of the better leapers in the country. Bucks by as many as 30. And then Mr. Jennings, the alley, oops, to Telford. And the mocks mocked by the Bucks, 93 to 70 East Tennessee State picks up the victory avenging an earlier loss as they have only lost two games on the year their 26th consecutive home victory that's fourth best in the NCAA next game will be against Belmont Abbey he isn't the most recognized Jennings on TV but Keith is a better player than Peter is here's how he stacks up against some of the country's better guards you see that he is first in total assists in the country he is third in average at 9.4. He doesn't take a whole lot of three-point shots, but when he does, he makes them. He was four for four tonight. Earlier tonight on ESPN.